welcome to digital learning dear students today we are going to learn 21st lesson lesson from unit 3 of business mathematics of bcom program of mangalore university the topic which we are going to begin today is equations and in this unit equations today's session will be about linear equations introduction to linear equations we will learn the meaning of linear equations the last session we have discussed about the number system indices simple compound interest annuities and present value the learning objective of today's session is to know the meaning of equation and its use in solving the problem after listening to this session the students will be able to demonstrate the skills in formulating simple equations students what is the meaning of equation every equation of nth degree has a total n real or imaginary roots every equation has n number of imaginary or real roots if alpha is the root of equation f of x is equal to 0 in equation f is f of x is equal to 0 if alpha is the root then the polynomial function of x is exactly divisible by x minus alpha polynomial function of x is divisible it can be divided by x minus alpha that is x minus alpha is the factor of given polynomial function of x in algebra the study of algebraic equation which are equations defined by the polynomial is called theory of equation theory of equation means it is the study of the algebraic equations when we say equations there are two sides one is left hand side and other one is right hand side the product or the sum of the both the sides should be equal the sum of both the sides should be equal for example x plus 1 is equal to 0 or x plus 1 is equal to 3 so both the sides when you put some value on x both the sides should be equal a polynomial is an expression consisting of one or more items polynomial means it is an expression it is expressed in algebraic terms and it consists of one or more terms <coughs> important concepts covered under the theory of equations linear equations simultaneous linear equations finding the integer solution of an equation or of a system of equations system of polynomial equations these are the concepts which are covered under the uh, theory of equations linear equation what is this linear equation there are different types of equation among different types uh, the one of among the different types linear equation is uh, one of the important one a linear equation is an algebraic equation we should know that it is also an algebraic equation in which terms are constants if the terms which are in equations are constants or product of a constants it may be a constant or product of a constant constant means it does not change its value doesn't change when i give the example you can understand and variables so in a in a linear equation we have a equation wherein there are constants and also variables constants may be one constant or a product of constants and also variable linear equations can have one or more variables so in one linear equation we it uh, we we should know that in a linear equation it may have only one variable or also more than one variable it may have one variable or more than one variable example with one variable <coughs> 2x minus 3 is equal to 5. So this is the equation. See left hand side, we have 2x minus 3. Right hand side, we have 
in this we have three items which are constants 2 3 and 5 they are constants x this is variable 2 3 5 the value doesn't change 2 its value is always 2 3 its value is always 3 5 its value is always 5 it doesn't change but x it is not like that x value may change we may put uh, the value <coughs> in the place of x uh, it may change it is subject to change isn't it and here another one with two variables 2x plus 3y is equal to 7 here 2 3 and 7 are constants we have two variables x and y another uh, thing we have to study here is system of equations or simultaneous equations what is this simultaneous equations there are two equations in simultaneous equations a pair of linear equations so it is a pair of linear equations two linear equations makes one simultaneous equation there are two linear equations so, a pair of linear equations in two variables, but there are two variables, two equations, two linear equations with two variables. So, a pair of linear equations in two variables is said to form a system of simultaneous linear equation. Example is 4x minus 6y minus 8 is equal to 0. Here, there are two variables x and y. And another one x plus 7y minus z1 is equal to 0. Here x and y are the variables. So this and this put together we call it as simultaneous equations. It forms a system of two linear equations. Two linear equations in variable x and y. So to conclude we can say in sum the theory of equation is the study of algebraic equations. There are several uh, sorry they are also called as polynomial equations when you conclude you should know the use of equation in business in the business field the equations are used for different purposes mainly the equations are used by the business managers for various uh, uh, calculations like uh, business managers use the linear equations in order to find the cost, profit, revenue, loss and even the break even point in their business. So it is of use in the business. <clears throat> From this session I have some MCQ multiple choice questions. Every equation of n sorry every equation of nth degree has a total n real or imaginary dash roots equations squares decimals second question in algebra study of algebraic equations where which are equations defined by a dash is called the theory of equations polynomial binomial both of the above none of them next question a dash is an algebraic equation in which terms are constant Terms are a constants or the product of constants and variables. What type of equation is this? Quadratic, linear, simultaneous, none of the above. Next uh, question is 2x minus 3 is equal to y is an example for quadratic equation, linear equation, simultaneous, none of the above. Fifth question is <coughs> forms. It forms a system of simultaneous equation forms simultaneous simultaneous equation forms a system of equations a system of dash so the question is simultaneous equations forms a simultaneous equations forms a system of dash equations in 
variable x and y. The question is very much clear. Simultaneous equations forms a system of dash vary equations in variables x and y. Two linear equations, one linear equations, three linear equations, none of the above. This is the end of this session and before we end I am presenting here before you the answers for these five multiple choice questions. These are the answers. The books we can refer for, you can refer for further studies is given here, Business Mathematics by Rakshita K. and Chandan UA. Thank you students for listening to the class.